So you're looking for an auto blogging software for AI SEO writing. So essentially you want a blog that automatically generates and posts articles to your site. Now, articles like this, which are the ones that I'm gonna show you right now, because before I show you how to automatically post the articles, I'm gonna show you how the articles that you're gonna be posting look like. So this are, these are some articles for the gardening niche. Now this software publishes articles in every single, every single niche and every single language. But what you see here, from the featured image, from the table of contents, the proper content extraction, the in-article images, all this is AI generated. Internal links, external links, even videos, it adds videos that are relevant to what the content is about to complement the written content, right? Bullets, tables, quotes, internal links, so linking out to other posts we've written, uh, external links, linking out to authority sources or any claims you, we make, we link out to Wikipedia, Investopedia, all these authority publications in your niche, right? All this done with AI, and I can skim through these ones, and I can click here to publish them one by one, to my site one by one, or I can just click here, publish all, all six, will be posted to my integration. Or again, if you want to automate, if I actually have an auto blog, I just go here to auto blogs and I click new auto blog and I just select how many articles I want to produce and publish every single month, week, 12, uh, day, 12 or six hours. So essentially most people just do this five a week. And what this does is where you're connecting the AI with your blog, this is your blog, right? And every week, right, five articles, so Monday through Friday, one article every day is published to your site. These are individual articles. And of course, these ones all look like the ones I showed you before with in article images, videos, tables, bullets, quotes, links. So these articles link, interlink between each other in a way that makes sense. All this automatically. So the AI generates plus publishes content to your site on autopilot. Now, there's a lot of nuance here. So you might be wondering, okay, but it publishes the articles on what topic and to what site does it publish the articles to? So regarding the site, you can connect this with anything you want really. You can connect this with WordPress, Shopify, Ghost Weeks, Webflow Blogger, even Zapier or an external API. So just set this up. It takes like 30 seconds to connect. And once it's connected, again, you can just have the auto blog running and having the articles being generated and posted to your uh, uh, site on autopilot. Now, in terms of generation, right, just go to generate articles right here. And this is the input you give to the AI, right? You could use ChatGPT, right? And the input would be the text saying, write me an article on X, Y, and Z. But in this case, the input is much better because we all know that with AI, the better the input, the better the output. So this is the input you give to the AI, right? So you select how many articles you want. Let's do 300, right? Uh, how many videos you want? Or do you want videos in your articles? If yes, disable or enable. Do you want images? What, what type of images do you want, right? Featured images, in-article images. You can even select AI-based images if you do so you can have e extra prompts. You can set up your um, linking here, the external links and the internal links. Again, external links are links linking out to external authoritative sources. For example, let's say this article is about finance, right? We maybe link out to Wikipedia, maybe we link out to Investopedia, maybe link out to Bloomberg, right? When we make some claims, when we want to link out to the sources of our claims or of our or the things we say here, we link out to these authority sources automatically. Internal linking is the same, but for internal links on the site, so linking out to other blog posts we've written, maybe linking out to our homepage, maybe even linking out to your services page or our product page if you're using a Shopify store, maybe linking out to your contacts page or all this, then automatically, right? So we write the article all for you, all the all it written and then we go okay where's the best place to add a link to and then we see okay for internal links where's the best page we can link out to and for external links the same thing all this done automatically you can change all this right here article size all these sections you can even add a custom call to action formatting you can even connect this to the web so that the content is up to date you can connect this with a knowledge base so that the content is brand tailored so you just connect right here and the content the ai produces because it is connected with your brand right the content is going to be brand tailored using your own brand's tone of voice, your brand's mannerisms, your brand's images. So not just some just some generic AI based content. Uh, speaking of content, you can generate content in over 150 different languages. It's pretty cool, right? You can select the target country, you can select the creativity levels, you can change the tone of voice, you can change the point of view, you can change the formality, you can even add custom instructions and include exact keywords in your articles. Um, and finally, you can generate content based off of titles, based off of keywords, based off of descriptions, or based off of a keyword monitor, which is this same thing right here. Keyword monitors, you just go here, add your site, add your target language, add your country, and it will give you a list of keywords that you can produce content for, right? A list of all these keywords. And then, of course, you connect the AI with your site via an auto blog, and so it does the keyword research for you, right? And then it generates the content based off of this keyword research. Then it automatically publishes the content to your site. And also if you want, it automatically indexes the content on Google. Just go here and set up an indexer. And all these posts, as soon as they're posted to your site, right? You can also have them syndicated to social media by going here automatically. So syndicate it to your LinkedIn page, syndicate it to your Twitter page, which is now called X, syndicate it to your Facebook page, all of these on autopilot. So the autoblogging isn't just about 
generating and posting articles, it is, right? But we also add indexing, we also add social syndication to the mix, and also, of course, keyword research on autopilot. All of these on autopilot. On top of that, you can have multiple autoblogs, right? You can have an autoblog in Portuguese, one in Spanish, one in Greek, right? You can have all these autoblogs running in the back. And what some companies do, some e-commerce companies, is that they have their main brand right here, their main Shopify store, right? Main Shopify store. And of course, they have their main blog, which tends to be in English, right? But then they have a blog in Portuguese, right? For slash PT. And then they have a blog in Spanish, for slash ES. And then they have a blog in, in French, right? So they have all of these, in this case, targeting European countries, all these blogs ranking for localized keywords in each of these countries, and then they send all the traffic to the main Shopify store on Autopad. So they have, these, they have multiple auto blogs, one for each country, right? Which is pretty cool, all automated with journalist AI. So yeah, that's it. If you have any questions, let me know, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.